now at 23 minutes past the hour. Now a live look at the nation's capital this morning where there's a, a little rally going on. I say a little. It's on the National Mall. Expected to be a big turnout and a big deal. This is a rally that, of course, has its eyes on the midterm elections. Whether working or unemployed, a coalition of liberal groups say the rally is for people to come together and focus on a positive agenda. And a blogger, Haroon Saleen, is already there. In fact, he's been crossing the country. He went on a cross-country trip blogging across America about hot-button political issues. He's joining us now from Washington. Haroon, thank you for being here, sir. What are you doing there? Uh, how are you, TJ? Pleasure to be here as well. What am I doing here? I'm part of uh, 400 other groups that are here. Uh, I think we're, we're all uh, here to you know, bring people together to talk about the, the issues that uh, are of concern right now in the country. I think when you look at uh, what's been going on, not just in the past eight years, but the, the last couple years, uh, there's, there's a little bit of frustration. I think there's a need to move beyond divisive uh, politics, and that sort of brought all these organizations together. Uh, I see a ton of people from the NAACP right around the corner right now. They're one of 400 groups here, and the hope is that you know, people on the Hill will, uh, our representatives will notice that uh, we have uh, concerns and we have something to say and that we yeah. want them to refocus what uh, what's going on in the country. Now, Haroon, you said uh, upset about what happened uh, the eight years of the previous administration, but you also mentioned what's been happening the past couple of years. Is this rally meant to send a message directly to President Obama that some of you all, you maybe in particular, not happy with what you've been seeing the past couple of years? Um, I'm not going to say me in particular. I do think there are people that are just concerned would probably be the right word. I think other people would say frustrated. For me, I think it's just an opportunity to say, hey, we still, uh, you know, there's still things that need to be done. Uh, I think it's two years is a short amount of time. I'm going to give the administration a little bit of credit. I think they've done a lot of great things, but I think... Uh, uh, I think uh, the administration knows it themselves. There's still work to be done. Uh, I think this is geared a little bit more towards uh, the Hill, though, not necessarily the administration. That's, that's my personal feeling. That's your personal feeling. Haroon, um, is there a feeling as well that this rally needs to in some way compete with, uh, at least match or maybe outdo what we saw uh, several weeks ago when Glenn Beck had a huge rally there, <laughs> or with some of the huge Tea Party rallies. I should have seen that question coming. I, is there a feeling that, that uh, this needs to, that, that you have to compete in some way? I, I wouldn't necessarily say compete. I think it's just the opportunity. For everyone here, it's an opportunity for us to just, you know, we, we want our voices heard. I wouldn't, to me, competition, et cetera. You know, look, they, Tea Party just have a right to, to speak as well. That's, uh, that is the, uh, uh, the, you know, that's what, uh, what's written in the Constitution. Um, so I wouldn't necessarily say compete at all. All right, well, Haroon Salim, I know you've had a long trip to get there. And you talked about some of those NAACP oh, yeah. <laughs> folks uh, right around the corner from you. We're going to be talking to them as well. Haroon, we appreciate being able to chat with you. Glad you make it there safely. Uh, enjoy the rally today. Good luck getting back. A safe trip back uh, home as well. But thank you so much, Haroon, Salim, and like you said, NAACP Thanks so folks. much. I'm glad they're flying me back this time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's shorter that way. He did have a long trip, folks.